Hello, DJI recently announced they're making major changes to the privacy mode in the DJI app required for flying your drones. This is, in my opinion, one of the biggest announcements they've made since releasing the Mavic Pro. Now, what is it? They are making no-fly zones an optional restriction. You can use local data mode to not publish your internet data and not be required to have internet to take off. This means that when you're flying, those soft no-fly zone warnings will go away. It also means the hard no-fly zones, you'll be able to fly straight through those invisible walls. I've hit those before on college campuses where if you're within a mile of an airport, you'll hit a strict no-fly zone while you're in the air. I've also seen other ones where I'm within a couple miles of a local airport and it won't let me take off because it's a no-fly zone. Now. We don't have this yet. The blog post was released on October 2nd, and they said it would come in the coming weeks. It's originally made for enterprise and military, but it's going to be super helpful for consumers also. Supposedly, you just log into your app, go to the DJI Go, and hit activate LDM, local data mode, and then enter your password to confirm this change. It's worth noting that this is an entirely separate change than the needing to be logged into DJI to use the app and to take off. That is still required, which is a bummer, but it's nice that they're getting rid of these no-fly zone restrictions. Now, what does this mean for you as a pilot? If you turn on LDM, then you can no longer use GPS features. Return to home. You're not going to be able to see the map of where you're at. You're not going to be able to do point to fly. I doubt they didn't mention this in there, but I don't think you'll be able to do a point of interest because that also requires GPS. However, it'll still record on the drone your speed, your altimeter, and your distance traveled. So the basic requirements, but you lose a lot of the functionality of having internet. Now, this is a good trade-off. I personally will fly in LDM mode quite a bit based on where I live. I live near uh, in West LA, which is like near uh, LAX, near Santa Monica Airport, and a couple other small no-fly zones. So it'll be very helpful for me, but I feel like users are going to be constantly turning it on and off depending on where they are and the features that they want. This is a huge release for us, and we're excited in the next couple weeks to see this. I'd expect it by October 14th. The current versions run DJI Go 4.12, uh, 4.1.12, and the Mavic firmware is 1.04. So I'm not sure what the other version does up. But you should expect those in the coming weeks. And I know a lot of people don't upgrade, but this is going to be a huge upgrade worth having because it's one of the few upgrades that gives you more abilities rather than restricting them. DJ did make a point of saying that even with this change, you're responsible for your drone. You're responsible for the local laws and you're supposed responsible for safety. Uh, so take that however you will. But for me, I'm really excited for the more possibilities that I just got when flying it.